Hi friends, it's me, Cookie, and I'm super excited that this Sunday is Easter. Oh, so excited, I can't wait. But for now, we have this. I am going to turn eggs into crystals. They're so exciting. And there's even, you can make foam, you can dye the eggs. It's like a whole kit. It's got a bunch of different things. And it even says three activities for hours of fun. I mean, it's written on the package how much fun we're going to have. So let's go. So before we can even make any crystals, we had to do a lot of prep work. So these are actual real eggshells. You can see them from real eggs in your refrigerator. We had to use this nifty, use this nifty tool, and, and then we had to take scissors, cut these. I mean, it has been a lot, but it's going to be so much fun. Like I'm super excited about it. So let's continue on. Now using the glue that they gave us, we're putting one drop of glue in each egg. That's what it says to do. Here instructions. Then over there. And then it says to take your finger and move it around on the inside to get the glue to um, move all over the place. Because after this, we're going to put some of the crystal growing powder. Okay, now we've taken the glue and we're moving, you can't really see it, but the crystal powder around inside, around the egg. Oh. <laughs> and it did say only use a half a tablespoon, so that's exactly how much we did add to it. So I'm taking it, oh, you can kind of see when they fell out a little bit. Um, the crystal powder and I am moving it around onto the glue and then we're going to let these sit for a little while just so they can dry and then while these are drying I'm going to move on to making the solutions to make these crystals. Now we have about six beakers and they're all about, I know I've got it a little tipped, but it's, they're all about, about 40 milliliters. Now it wants us to take two level spoonfuls. Let's say that's about one. In. It's a little, it's kind of like sand texture. It's kind of neat actually, these crystals. One more. Now, we're going to take this and we're going to stir it and we're going to bring it over to the microwave. 15 second increments until this is dissolved. It says do not go past three, so I'll be right back. All right, so we just got this out of the microwave. Not sure if you can see the steam, but it certainly is warm, so be careful. It did take three times going in at 15 seconds each. It's all stirred up. Now, the next step is to take one of these little dies and boop. Ooh. Sizzling. Mix it in. Look at it. It's smoking. <laughs> that is so cool. Now it says just let it dissolve. That's so cool. Just hear it. All right. Now we'll go on to the next step. All right. Once this is all dissolved, it took a little bit, but it was actually really cool because it steamed, it made noises. We're going to take this and we're going to it says submerge there we go and it is submerged and then we'll give this 12 to 15 hours and we'll see you in about 12 to 15 hours and we will see how these look i'll see you there 
But in the meantime, we're going to do some more, and I'm going to ask my friend to come help me. I'm sure he's going to love this. So my friend decided to join me for this amazing, excellent experiment. He picked out five different colors because we're going to put all five different colors in these beakers. We've already put them in the microwave, and the solution has already dissolved, so we're ready. Go ahead and take each one and put them inside. Ooh, yellow. <gasps> Blue. <gasps> I don't know what that is. Like a light blue. I like the blue one. Ooh, look at that. Do you hear them? Yeah, and also, I really like the blue. Me too. Look at them all. Ooh. I think we got two blues. I don't know. Kind of looks like a purple blue. We got to stir them up. Here, I'll let you just stir that up a little bit. You can stir those too, and I'll just quickly stir this one. Got to make sure we stir them. Once they start, uh, stop sizzling is actually when they are done. Now that they've all are ready, we're going to add in the little eggshells with the crystals. Go ahead and add them in. Nope, we're gonna put them in like that. There, let it submerge, just let it go in. Yep, go ahead, keep going. There you go. Go ahead, keep going, I'll just push this one in. Yeah. Yep, that was perfect. There you go. Then while he's doing that, I'm going to just splash a little bit. Make sure the whole egg gets... There you go. And then I'm wiping the spoon off because I do not want the colors to mix at all. There we go. Great job. Doing great over here. All right, and we're almost done. And now we just have to give these, like I said, between 12 and probably 16 hours, and then we will come back and hopefully they'll have crystals all over them. Well, friends, the results are in, and the eggs came out excellent. See, there's this one. There's a couple, here we go. And then... And also, this was my favorite color. <laughs> they all came out really great. And we had a really fun time making them with you. And we hope you guys keep coming back for more and more fun with me, your friend Cookie. That's K-O-O-K-I-E. And that would be me. And don't forget to like and subscribe for more and more fun.